everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. At the beginning of the video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I hope that you are doing well and that you are still... Yes, and be safe from the virus and stay... Exactly, so we need to stay at home and we need to stay positive. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how I prepare mini pizzas. Those mini ones are really special. There's something about that. And all the kids love it. It's perfect if you organize a play date for your child or a birthday party. And now my husband would say, it's also good for adults. Yes, it's also good for adults, for appetizers. It's just perfect. This dough is so soft and fluffy and so easy to make. So let's get started. In 300 milliliters of warm water, add a half teaspoon of sugar. A teaspoon of salt. And a teaspoon of dry yeast. Mix it well and let it activate for a few minutes. Sift 500 grams of all-purpose flour. Add 100 milliliters of vegetable oil. And now we can add activated yeast. Now all the ingredients for the dough are inside ready to be combined. You can do it with your mixer with a dough extension or by hand. The dough is combined and it's on a runny side and that's totally fine. Now we just need to cover it and let it grow. The dough grew so well. Sprinkle your surface with a little bit of flour. Dump the first half of the dough. It's easier if you work in halves. Fold it a few times. Coat your rolling pin with a little bit of flour and start rolling the dough. You can make little circles with cookie cutter or with a glass. You can simply pick the size. I picked this cookie cutter. Put the circles on the baking paper, cover them and let them grow for a little bit. In 300 milliliters of tomato puree, add 3 grams of salt. Mix it well. Add some oregano to taste. and a little bit of sugar to kill the sourness. The circles grew, they are nice and puffy. From this amount of dough, you will have around 30 mini pizzas. At this point, you will also need 300 grams of shredded mozzarella cheese. Add 
basically now we need to press every single circle with our finger so we make the middle of the circle thinner and we leave edges a little bit puffy so we make sure the filling doesn't come out Now we can start coating our pizzas with the sauce we prepared. Now you can start adding mozzarella cheese. And I'm just going to sprinkle a little bit oregano for the final touch. We need to bake them between 380 and before the end on 390 degrees in Fahrenheit which is between 190 and 200 degrees in Celsius for around 15 minutes in total. The dough is super soft and fluffy and you are going to love it. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave me like and subscribe to my channel. Stay safe, stay positive and see you soon. Bye!